breaking news the vice presidential candidates on the platform of the people's democratic party pdp at the 2019 general election peter obi has picked the parties nomination and express of interest forms to contest for the 2023 presidency obi who had joined the presidential race barely a week ago we now contest against his former boss ex-vice president atiku abubakar who had earlier obtained the form to v for the same position the nomination and expression of interest forms were said to have been purchased by group the like minds lm led by ekene Owachiche. Owakuchi described Like Minds as a group of young Nigerian professionals that feel the country is not going in the right direction and needs a seasoned technocrat that can steer the affairs of the country in the right direction. Daily Trust reports. He said, if the country can cut down the cost of governance, things will be better and we believe the person that can do that is Peter Obi. The group, group pardon, comprising of professionals, businessmen, public servants, a different category of contractors, artisans, said, we want the country to move forward. We think Peter Obi can steer it forward and we believe in him because we've seen what he did in Anambra when he was a governor. And we have heard him talk. He has the wealth of experience to lead Nigeria to the promised land. We are doing this because of our children because if we don't get it right this time around, this 2023, I don't know where we will be. Each and every one of us here knows how the country is and we want a better Nigeria. I believe that if you are from Nigeria, be it from the north, be it from the south, east, west, you want a better Nigeria. The leader said they are working with other groups like Take Back Nigeria, which had promised to mobilize 10 million votes for PDP and Peter Obi. The Nigerian dream we're all looking for can be achievable and the old person that we believe, you know, that can help us. The Nigerian dream is no other person than Mr. Peter Gregory Obi, he said. What is your thought to this? We've just heard that Peter Obi is the only person who is capable of leading Nigeria to the promised land. What is your own thought to this? Don't forget that Bola Mentinobu, who is a former Lagos State Governor and the APC Chairman, don't forget, you know, the APC Party Leader, he has also said he's strong, he's capable, he's worthy and has the power to pilot the affair of Nigeria to greatness. Same thing is what Peter Obi have just said. That is what has been said. Saying that he is also capable and is ready to contest against his former boss, the ex-Vice President Atiku Abubakar. What is your thought to this? We would like you to let us know your own reaction to this plan development. Nigerians, it's high time for us to wake up from our slumber because we've suffered enough and it is now we have to make the right choice because if we don't make the right choice, I don't know where we are going to be. Just like what has been said in the news. We would like you to let us know your thoughts. This is said that we think Peter Obi can steer it forward. That is, Peter Obi can steer Nigeria forward and we believe in him because we have seen what he did in Anambra 
when he was a governor. Don't forget that Bola Mejinobu also did a lot in Lagos State when he was a governor. So if you say Peter Obi is worthy because of what he did in Anambra State, then would you say Bola Mejinobu, though different parties, would you say Bola Mejinobu is not worthy looking at what he has done in Lagos State? What is your thought to this? We would like you to let us know your own reaction to this planning development. We would like you to share it all with us via the comment section on this that has been said. But before we go, let's people's reactions and know their thoughts about this. Let's see what people have felt concerning the present situation of things in Nigeria. Salvation Prince reacted and said, Without sentiment or tribal feeling, Peter Obi is the most credible, qualified person for the job. No sentimental tribe. Nigerians needs of visionary leader, not greedy wicked cabals that will only inflict suffering, pain and impunity on the masses. That is a reaction from Salvation Prince saying that Peter Obi is the most credible, qualified person for the job. What is your thought to this? What is your own reaction to this plan development? The citizen Hondu also say article is not the only presidential candidate, I love him much. What is your thought to this? Despite the numbers of presidential aspirants we have, it has been said by Hundu saying that he loves Atiku the most. Honestly, we have different supporters of Atiku, we have different supporters of Peter Obi, and we have different supporters of other presidential aspirants. But the problem is, who is gonna win this election? Where is such person coming from? I think that is the most, you know, important thing now. And it is in our hands as Nigerians to pick the best among the best. Because we wouldn't want to suffer again. Jubri said, election are not won by sentiment or emotion. It is now people, we realize that the horse bridle is far larger than the brick of a fowl. Dazin Dakop also said he might be competent but he can beat Atiku in the primaries. Elections will never solve Nigeria's problem, only a revolution will. What is your thought to this? We've also had another reaction from Dazin saying that he might be competent but he cannot beat Atiku in the primaries. We would like you to let us know your own point of view to this. Don't forget that. Still talking about the 2023 presidency, the ex Anambra governor, Peter Obi, as speaks the PDP presidential form to contest against Atiku during the 2023 election. Thank you guys for listening. To subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on other news. Bye for now.